Move aside, move aside. Deep breath. I'll be right there. Child of the Qin family, can't be abandoned. Mr. Qin, who shall we save? You must decide now. Neither of them. What did you say? Because Mu Yu is my boyfriend. I had Mu Yu pursue you. He never loved you. He married you, just to help me reclaim the Chao group. Mu Yu, is that the truth? Don't look at me like that. Xi Ya is right. Only with your death can I regain all your fortune. And the child in your belly can't be kept. Or the board members would definitely let that child become the heir. I can't risk that. Sima Yu, you're a beast. This is your child after all. Oh yes, there's a secret I haven't shared. Nine months ago, when you were drunk at Fontainebleau, it wasn't Mu Yu who you slept with. In fact, I got you drunk and sold you to a pretty boy. For a million dollars. Chao Xia, you monster. She's distressed. She needs first aid. Move. Chao Ximun, wait for your end. You're doomed already. Let's go. Chi Mu Yu, falling for you was my mistake. In my next life, I don't want to have anything to do with you. You must save her, at all costs. Yes, Mr. Qin. Mr. Ken, the baby's here, but with a blocked airway. Needs first aid. Save him, or your hospital will be history. Yes. See, Shell. I'll check on the baby. You stay here. Okay. Baby, I will always protect you. Could it be Chin Mu and Chao Xia are back? Mr. Ken, she ran away. Find her. Turn the place upside down. Jiang City, I have returned. Lim Yu, Chao Xia, I'll make you pay for the pain. Because seven years ago, Shiman, Shiman, you're finally back. Missed you heaps. Listen to me, Shiman. I've heard word got out you're returning home. Since last night, I've been flooded with calls. For real? Hmm. Miss Chu, are most of them actually your unwanted admirers? Of course not. My friend is a globally acclaimed neurologist, Doctor Jocelyn. Shouldn't they be seeking her in lines? All right, all right. Thank you. Let's go shopping. You buy, I'll pay. Thanks, my love. Miss Chu, you're such a flatterer. What was that? I might wet myself. Hurry up then. Your mom and I will wait here. Chao Shima, you're still kicking. Did you seduce the doctor to save yourself? <laughs> Just like your mother. A natural siren. Good only at enticing men. Chao Shia, if you keep harassing me, I won't hesitate to put you in your place. Shia, don't bother with scum. We're still waiting for Doctor Joseline. Don't let her see this; it'll disgrace yourself. Doctor Joseline? Seems like you haven't achieved much these years. You don't even know the renowned Doctor Joseline. <laughs> still, she hasn't changed. The same old room. Doctor Joseline is a top-tier doctor. As long as Mu Yu gets Doctor Joseline to treat Patriarch Qin, he'll climb the ranks in the Qin family. When Patriarch Qin picks his heir, Mu Yu might just edge out Qin Yucheng and inherit the family fortune. By then, we'll be beyond your reach forever. Can the Qin family manage to get Doctor Joslin? I suggest you shouldn't boast. You might end up red-faced. How dare you! The past years have made you sharp-tongued. I'll teach you a lesson. Xia. Chao Shima, you dare hit me? Chao Shia, we haven't settled the score from seven years ago. Consider this slap an extra gift. You.
You hypocrite, I'll rip your face off. Stop! Mr. Queen? Yu Cheng, what brings you here? Are you here to get Dr. Jocelyn for Shida? I've learned enough. She's Su Shan Yu, Dr. Jocelyn's assistant in China. What gives you the right to call my name? Call me Mr. Chin. Take her away. What are you up to? Mr. Chin, this woman has been plotting against us. Otherwise, we would have approached Dr. Jocelyn. You're hindering our family affairs. This man looks formidable. No, I need to lure him away before. Shi Bao comes back. I know where Dr. Jocelyn is. Spare Shan Yu, I'll come with you. You know where Dr. Jocelyn is? Stop bragging here! How could you know that? You'd better not be lying. Take her! No need. I can walk. Shiman. Tell me where Joseline is, and I'll let you go. Is this how you ask for a favor? This looks more like a kidnapping. If you don't spill Jocelyn's whereabouts, I assure you, this could turn into a real kidnapping. You're just wasting your breath. Jocelyn has her principles. Rule number one is the Chin family is off limits. Is that so? Your life hangs by my thread. I wonder if Jocelyn will break her rule for us? Hey! Let me out. Hey. Locked in this place. I can't reach Sibel. Sibel? Why are you here? Who is this woman? Where did Shan Yu go? You must be scared. Can't even utter a word. Mom! Mom! You're my mom! Of course. Dummy. Can't recognize your mom? So my dad wasn't lying. Dad really brought my mom home. You're babbling. You must be really scared. Oh, my poor boy. Hurry, let's go! <laughs> Shiman, that woman, who was that? Mr. Chin, bad news. That woman escaped and took Shijie with her. What? You can't even keep an eye on a child. Ask Ling Zixiao to look for him. Find him or pack your bags. Yes. Shayda, I finally found you. I don't know you. Mr. Chin is worried sick. Let's go home. Let go of me. I want my mom. Enough with the mother talk. It's a sore spot for your dad. Chin Shizhi, you're really growing bolder. I want to see my mom. Mr. Chin, don't be mad. Shizhi, he is just frightened. Forgive him. Frightened? He looks quite lively. Take him back. Shizhi's mental state seems a bit off. Should we get a doctor for him? Plus, this problem runs in your family. I didn't call you here to lecture me on parenting. Can we trust Dr. Jocelyn? Seems like Chin Muyu is on her trail too. I can't trust his choices. Don't worry, he doesn't have the chops to sway Jocelyn. Now, help me with this. St. Mary's Medical College, your girlfriend? This woman knows Jocelyn. Arrange for the hospital to recruit her as a neurologist. But she's a cardiologist. But Jocelyn is a neurology expert. You suspect? Okay. I'll go talk to Hu Yin. As long as you ask, she'd never refuse. Hello. Chao Shiman. I thought you'd be thrown into a river by Mr. Chin. Buzz off. Are you worthy of being in this plush place? Young lady, please mind your manners. 
Miss Chiao is our esteemed guest. She's booked a villa worth 180 million. Just her? Chiao Shiman, stop pretending. You didn't get any of the Chiao's wealth. How can you afford this? Right. Chiao Shiman, care to wager? Bet on whether you have so much money. Really? What's at stake? You've been eyeing the Chiao's wealth for ages. If I lose, I'll give you the old house. Okay. Write it down. Sign here. What? Scared? It doesn't matter. You're just being yourself, a pathetic coward. We'll sign. If you lose, you'll bark and crawl like a dog. Leave Zhang Yun District. Okay. A deal's a deal. Miss Chow, your card. Still pretending? You're a good actress. If you don't crawl like a dog later, I'll make you do it again. This is the supreme black card. Only ten in existence. It has a balance of two bills. The transaction amount is 180 million. It can't be right. You're lying. Oh, I get it. Cashman hired you as an actor, right? Mr. Liu, I'll double your fee. Now expose her tricks. Sir, you... Not okay? I'll offer triple. She can't possibly have two billion. Let alone the Supreme Black God. If you don't stop, I'll call security. Perhaps you should call someone to bring the property to you. Or will you do it yourself? That's the Chow family's house. Why should I hand it over? Look, it's written on the paper here. Regret it? You. It's okay if you don't want to. Then we'll have to take this to the court. Don't celebrate just yet. Remember you've crossed Mr. Chin. For that alone. You can't stay in Zhang Yun District. Exactly. You dare to sell a house to someone who's crossed Mr. Chin. Mr. Chin will come after you. Hello, are you Chao Shiman? I'm Mr. Chin's assistant, Ling Zixiao. Chao Shiman, you're screwed. This man is Mr. Chin's right-hand man. The one he trusts the most. You must be here to reprimand him. Show some respect to her. Mr. Chin asked me to invite Miss Chow to work at St. Peter's Hospital. What? She's crossed Yu Ching. The Huo family will hire her? I wasn't informed that Miss Chow has offended him. Also, don't call him Yu Ching. You might tarnish his name. St. Peter's Hospital is the top hospital in the nation. Only a select few can get in. A country bumpkin like you can get in there? There's a lot you didn't know. Prepare the key and property details for the house. Is there a mistake? I specialize in cardiology, not neurology. Miss Chow, hear me out. You graduated from St. Mary's Medical College. Even if as a novice, you'd grasp it easily. Also, you're skilled in lockpicking. This is truly a revelation. Thank you. Doesn't Mr. Chin also have a knack for abduction and surveillance? You're indeed sharp. What are you looking for? Oh, a tracking app. Don't screw it up. Okay. If I intended to kidnap you, would you still be standing here? What the hell do you want? Are you all right? No. If I step in to help him, Chin Yu Ching is smart enough to deduce that I'm Jocelyn. Is it an old problem? I'll get Huo Yin. That medical wonder. She clinched a great medical award at just 24. If she's here, things should be okay. Since you've got a helper, I'll take my leave. You'll need to go to the hospital with Mr. Kin. Huh? Who are you? He suddenly fell ill. He clutched Miss Chow's hand. Couldn't let go. Fetch a needle. Her technique can relieve migraines, but it can also impact the brain. If used in conjunction with hypnosis, it could distort one's memory. This is odd. Aren't the Chin and Huo families on good terms? Why would she endanger him? Ling Zixiao is standing right beside him. Is he unaware or...? Forget it. It's not my business. I'd better steer clear of this. 
If there's nothing else, I'll leave. Shimon. Mr. Chin, help. Size is on a hunger strike. What? He won't eat anything. Please hurry back. First, he went off. Now he doesn't eat? He's pushing my buttons! Size, you haven't eaten for a full day. Please have a bite. I won't. If you don't let me see my mom, I won't eat anything. You're pushing my buttons! Big devil, take this! What are you waiting for? Bring him back. Yes. Put me down. Big devil, picking on the weak. Such a coward! Challenge me if you dare! Chinshiza! Are you done? Who's Chinshiza? I'm Shibao, okay? Alright, alright. If you love this name, we'll call you Shibao. Did you confuse me with another? I'm not the Chinshiza you knew. My name is Shibao. My English name is Nison. I've been living overseas with my lovely mom. We just recently flew back home. Maid. Take him down. Put me down. Put me down. Should we go to get Miss Huo? He seems to show schizophrenic symptoms. Wo Yin's acupuncture works for me, but something doesn't feel right. Over the years, I seem to have lost many memories. Some memories even appear jumbled. My son can't afford any kind of mishaps. No need. Spread the word. Hurry it up. Find Jocelyn ASAP. Ladies, you had tea without me? We thought you were handing over the old house. To that woman, the new owner. Don't mention her. Just her name gets my goat. She doesn't have money. The Supreme Black card belongs to her boss. She's just the go-between. Oh? Really? Absolutely. If she really had the card, then why didn't we ever know about it? She fooled me with a hollow promise. I'll sue her for unlawful eviction. Xiaoxia, you're getting better at making things up. How do you know the card isn't mine? Or else? How could a single pregnant woman hold a top-tier supreme black card? You lie. Don't intimidate my mom. If my dad knows this, he won't forgive you. Your dad? When you were born, no one knows who your dad is. You mention him a lot. You ever met your dad? Do you know who he is? Standing up for your mom like that? Of course I know. Oh? Then I'm intrigued. Who's your dad? My dad is Chin Yu Cheng. Lives in Shangshan Mansion. They call him Mr. Chin. <laughs> Chao Shiman. The apple doesn't fall far from the tree. So young, yet already a fibber. Clearly, he's your child. And I'll give the remark back to you. You. Sibao, come here. You're fibbing. No, I'm not. If you don't trust me, I'll call my dad to summon him. To come here. Go on, call him. As you wish. Sibao, we shouldn't bother with a lunatic. Wasting our time. Let's go, it's dinner time. Sorry, Mom. I didn't know that she was ill. Now I get it. I won't engage with a mad woman. You think you can just leave after this show? No chance. You're not going anywhere until you clear this up. If I ask my dad to come here, you won't bother her anymore. If that's the case, I'll call him now. Sibo. What are you waiting for? Don't you know the number? Need me to tell you? Hope you won't cry. Oh my, I'm trembling. Enough, make the call. Did you wait? Hello? Dad? What's happening? Nothing. Mrs. Kin, I'm here by Mr. Kin's order to deliver these flowers. Greet, Mrs. Kin. Mrs. Kin. Mrs. Kin. Mrs. Kin. These blue cherry elms are from Mr. Chin's garden. Each one signifies his affection for you. That can't be. Absolutely not. Mrs. Kin, the flowers, take them away. 
Miss Chiao, I'm sorry. We didn't know you were Mrs. Kin. Our earlier behavior was misguided. Please forgive our ignorance. If you must apologize today, do it to my son. You better hope he forgives you. Otherwise, I will surely make you regret being born into this world. I want her. Kneel on the ground. Circling this place while doing so. Declare that Si Bao's mom is endearing. And that she's the ugly beast. Nobody adores. I won't do it. You cheat, kid. Don't overstep the mark. You won't do it? Then this matter will be dealt with by my dad. No, 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 please wait. You'll do it. Even if she's resistant, we have our ways to make her do it. Right. Just leave this woman to us. Please don't call Mr. Kin. What are you up to? Neil, move! This is bullying. This is crossing a line. Say it. Say it! Enough of talk. Shibao's mom is as endearing. I'm the ugly beast nobody adores. Let's go. This must be a scheme set by Toshima. There's no way she could be Mrs. Chin. Why can't you just trust me? Quit the talk. Can you crawl or not? I will do it. Do whatever you want. I won't do this anymore. This is all your handiwork. Stop! Muyu. It's okay. Don't be sad. You. Aren't you Xia's friends? Why would you treat her this way? Who wants to be her friends? We only befriended her out of sympathy. We don't wish to cross Mr. Kin. What? Xia, did you cross Mr. Kin? I didn't, I didn't. It's Chao Ximan's ploy. She tricked me into this. If not for her, I wouldn't be in this mess. Muyu, you must stand up for me. She even made me crawl on the floor. My knees hurt. I've been so disgraced. I can't confront life anymore. Don't worry. I'll make Chao Ximen pay twice over for what you suffered. Mrs. Kin, where should I set the flowers for you? Don't know what he's doing. But since he stood up for me today, I'll just accept these flowers. Mr. Ling, please help me move the flowers to the front yard. My yard might be a tad small for them. Later, I'll erect a flower shed on the roof and create a tiny garden. I'll take care of it. Not just a flower shed. Even a sky garden, I'll make it happen. Will that be too much of a bother? Not at all. It's my privilege to serve you, Mrs. Chin. He's been addressing me as Mrs. Chin. When did I become Mrs. Chin? Shiman, I found what you wanted. This medicine is for the whole family's private use. You can only secure it through inside connections. Impressive. I'll conduct a drug analysis. You can go to take a walk. I have to go now. Carry on with it. Don't mind me. I'll take your card. And go shopping. Bye. The whole family's medicine contains an extract patented by my mother. Shiman. I found a clue related to your mom. The whole family seems to be linked to her vanishing. So you're implying... The whole family. Is aiding Chin Muyu in abducting my mom? I can't confirm yet. But that's my hunch. Back then, your mom's medicines excelled those of Huo's. I believe they've held a grudge for a long time. Also, after your mom vanished, Huo's drug innovation skyrocketed. I suspect they've concealed her somewhere secluded to enhance their medicine. Shanyu's speculation was correct. I couldn't find Mom, because she's not with Chin Liu, but with the whole family. Now isn't the moment to take action. Mom, please hang in there. I'll surely rescue you. Toshiman, open the door! Come out! Shame on you! How dare you treat me like that? Don't forget, your mom is still with me. Don't force me to go back to kill her. Mind what you're saying here? Chashman, what are you doing? She has showed mercy and spared you, but you're ungrateful and act meanly. In this case, we have nothing to discuss. Just wait for your mom's death. If anything happens to my mom, you'll never get to approach Dr. Jocelyn. You found Dr. Jocelyn? Where is she? Tell me. Why should I tell you? Whether I say it or not, you and Chao Shia won't tell me where my mom is. 
I was teasing you earlier. Don't take it serious. Obviously, I won't harm your mom. If you tell me where Dr. Jocelyn is, I might even consider a fresh start with you. Where's this confidence coming from? I was drawn to you for your intelligence. You've not grown over these seven years. Now you're just aged and dim. No woman would like you. You... This slap is from my past self seven years ago. You're so ungrateful. Just you wait. I'm heading back to sever your mom's hand. You and Chao Xia keep mentioning my mom. But now I'm not even sure if she's alive. Give me a recent photo of her, and I'll tell you where Joslyn is. Fine. Keep your promise. Muyu! I was compelled to kneel all afternoon by this wicked woman. Are you just going to let it go? You crossed the line. You owe her an apology. Apology? An apology is enough? That's not what we agreed before we came here. Do you still have feelings for Chao Ximen? Can't stand to see her kneel before me? Chao Ximen, if you escape today, I won't let it go. This isn't over. These are invites to the Han family's soiree. You too? Take them and scram. Don't show your face again. Go! These are invites to the Han family's soiree. Hello? Hello, Mr. Ling. It's Shiza. I want to know if my dad is going to attend the Han family's soiree. He can't. He's booked for business. Could you persuade my dad to attend? Because... Mrs. Kin will go, right? Yes. Ah. Shiza, you're truly Mr. Kin's great helper. All right, I'll make sure he'll go. Thank you, sir. The flowers are set? Almost. When you're back from the Han soiree tomorrow, it should be done. I'm not going. Then, Miss Chow will have to go alone. I heard there's a dance tomorrow. I wonder who'll be the fortunate guy to dance with Miss Chow. Toshiman is attending the soiree? Yes. Why do you care if she goes or not? Anyway, you're not going. Ling Jixiao, cancel my meeting with Mr. Zhang tomorrow. Prepare my attire. I'm attending it. Sibo, which one's better? The black one. Hmm. Just like my boy. Great taste. Come here. My favorite is this one, too. After all, Dad is fond of black. Hideous, your clothes are all so ugly. And why do they all look exactly the same? No one asked for your take. Your taste is appalling. I have to improve your taste. Only clothes with duck are good looking. John, burn the picture book. But this duck picture book is Shi Zhe's favorite one. Burn it. Every page of it. From now on, no ducks are allowed in my mansion. How did you develop this warped taste? My son can't be this tacky. I hate you, big devil. My ducky. Well? Need a hand? Need a hand? I heard that Mr. Chin is a clean freak. He feels sick around any woman. But it seems that's not the case with Miss Chow. Mr. Kin, your wooing moves are quite outdated. Worse than gifting flowers? Who are you? Get away from my muse! Look up and see who I am. Oh, Yu Ching! She's your muse? Yes, she healed my grandfather. Oh? She's that good? Miss Chow, where have you been these years? I couldn't get a hold of you. I... Han Zisi, finished your homework? You seem idle. Should Zixi, I'll give you some tutoring? I'm busy. <laughs> Little Imp, you're quite in demand, huh? Yu Cheng. 
I thought you wouldn't come. I heard from Zixiao you were meeting Mr. Zhang for business. I didn't think he'd come. It's not your concern. Is it because I'm too chummy with Xia you're mad? Don't worry. Even though Xia is my bestie, when it comes to you and Qin Muyu, I'm always on your side. And even if Shizai really has some mental problems, I can help keep it under wraps. You don't need to worry about my son. Mr. Qin, you're quite popular. So many admirers. This one is better off discarded. Since Mr. Chen isn't charmed by the admirer downstairs, why not go upstairs for a chat? Just as I thought. At the hospital, she held Yu Chen's hand. Now she's hindering me, Huo San. Investigate everything about that woman. Got it. 